Well, good afternoon and welcome back to the uh, the evening, the afternoon session, if you will, of our part three of the workshop that we've been running now for about three weeks on looking at the barriers to overcome um, or to drive innovation in highly prevalent diseases. Uh, we've got a great session for this afternoon where we're going to wrap it all back up together. What we're going to do for the next hour or so, we're bringing back all the moderators from the first two sessions as well as from the session this morning to participate in a panel discussion to kind of discuss the overarching lessons learned, what we've heard from each of the presenters and from questions that have come in through the, through the WebEx uh, from each of you participating in this workshop. And they'll be talking about not only the lessons learned, but exciting areas for future actions, things that we should pay, um, pay particular attention to as we move forward, and lead us in some brainstorming uh, with the virtual audience for potential approaches or strategies to spur innovation in R&D for these prevalent chronic diseases. So let me briefly introduce each, each one of them before they begin. And, um, and they'll each share a brief summary presentation highlighting their takeaways and ideas. And then we'll open it up to a uh, moderated panel discussion and audience Q&A. So we'll have lots of time for participants online to ask questions. So please go ahead even now and start sending your questions in. We'll compile those and we really wanna have a robust discussion to bring the three sessions together, which ultimately culminate in the proceedings uh, from, from the workshop. So with that, let me first uh, introduce again, uh, Grace Colon, who joined us this morning and moderated the session. She's the Chief Executive Officer for Encarta Therapeutics. We also have in this session, uh, Bettina Drake, who was part of uh, workshop number two last week. She's a professor at Washington School of Medicine, Associate Director of Community Outreach and Engagement and the Alvin J. Seidman Cancer Center, at the Alvin J. Seidman Cancer Center. Also, we have in this session, Howie Rosen, who was a moderator in week one. He is a managing director of Bon Velo Ventures and a lecturer at Stanford University. And lastly, we have uh, important Susan, Susan Schaefer. She's the president and chief executive officer uh, for the Patients Academy for Research Advocacy. And she chaired the very first session uh, two weeks ago now. So with that, I think I will turn it over to the four of you. And I think Susan, perhaps you're starting. 